Gruškov je, kjer vozniki osebnih vozil na izstop iz države čakajo približno pol drugo uro. Na mejnem prehodu v Sečorje vozniki na vstop in izstop iz države čakajo eno uro. Povečen promet pri izstopu iz države je tudi na mejnih prehodih Dregonja, Dobovec in Sočerga. Alright, guys. I'm at my destination, the southest part of island of Krk in Croatia. Behind me, you can see the island of Prvic, uninhabited island. And one day I will go there and do some walking and so on. But let me now show you a few glimpses of where I am. Hi guys, Jan is coming your way. This is my third day at the coast here in Croatia on the island of Krk. Smoking my sorry for the lighting but it's Kildare Smooth number no. six with a Philip. And in it, I smoke Northwoods from Boswell. I received so many samples from various pipers that I still had just for one bowl of this really tasty tobacco. So I'm enjoying it on Sunday, as I said, you saw the footage at, at the beginning of the video was from Friday, when I was driving towards Kirk. The weather was nice, Saturday and Sunday were sunny, or Sunday is still sunny, and but it's a little bit windy, so the water is still too cold for swimming. But if you are outside and somewhere there where the wind is not blowing too much, you can be in t-shirt or yeah, you can be on, in t-shirt. This area that I showed you is actually a place that I return every year for more than 30 years. It's two and a half hour drive from Ljubljana, where I live. Depends on the, the traffic. And now we also had a uh, more thorough control when exiting Slovenia because Croatia is not in Schengen area for now and that means that they are actually checking every single passenger, all the documents are being scanned and so on. So, But I was lucky to, to come to the border just in time where there was like t 10 minutes necessary to wait and then I proceed I continued my, 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 my journey so I wasn't affected this is due to the anti-terrorist measures because, as you know, a lot of P 
people were entering European Union and of course also exiting that means the ones who were traveling to Syria to to, do, to join ISIL or Daesh or whatever do you call it Islamic State but Let's put aside this topic for now and let me just tell you that I was enjoying really nice three days. A little bit windy, but nevertheless sunny. Nights are still cold, but you can see the waves are not big. You cannot see the foam over the on the tips of the waves so it's not the wind is not blowing too much the land over there in that direction is island of Pervic as I told you this is island is uninhabited so maybe some uh, ships or goats are there but usually nobody nobody lives there but uh, not on this side as you can see there are there's not any beaches or something like that but on the other side there is a lot of beaches and people who have their own boats here travel there in the morning and then they return in the afternoon there is a there are two islands behind island of Pervic one is called Goli Otok or Naked Island and the other one is Gurgur island of Gurgur and Goli Otok was in previous system until I don't know when but maybe until 1980s a political Uh, prison for men and just next to the uh, Goli Otok or Naked Island was island of Gurgur where there was a uh, women's political prison so the former system that ended in 1991 had political prisons also here at the Adriatic coast so this sea that you see behind me this is Adriatic Sea that is connected to the Mediterranean Sea and countries that have the coast here are Italy, Slovenia, Croatia and further to the south uh, Bosnia and Herzegovina and then Montenegro Albania and then Greece and so on so it takes me good two and a half hours drive to here that is the same amount of time that I need to drive to Venice in Italy But I prefer this location because it's peaceful. Nevertheless, that in July and August there are a lot of people here. Not actually here where I'm sitting right now, but further back to the to the city of Bashka. That's the nearest town and the, where the roads stop. And then there is like one hour walk to the to the south steep of the island and island of Kirk is also the biggest 
island in Croatia that has most islands in the Adriatic Sea, I think around 1000 or something. Very nice coast, very nice islands. A lot of people from Europe come here for summer holidays. All over actually the Europe. Okay, I will join my pipe for around half an hour now. And let me show you a little bit around because you cannot you cannot see everything from from here. I will show you a little bit around and I hope you like it. I hope the wind was not too noisy or that you were able to see something because of the you know the light I'm using my phone so sometimes my face is more bright sometimes the and the background is brighter and so on so I hope this was not too disturbing. So I will show you around a little bit and until we meet again, I wish you a lot of pleasant smokes.